Where you fill a graduated cylinder will determine how accurate the measurement is. The specification of 1% is met at the full level of filling, in this case 100 milliliters. The specification of 1% can be met or exceeded when done correctly, and in this case you can see that the meniscus, the bottom of the curved portion, is touching the 100 milliliter mark. In this case we will be getting a 0.3% accuracy, or roughly 0.3 milliliters. In this instance, we're showing the measurement at the 50 milliliter mark, and in fact, the accuracy of 1% is still maintained, uh, and is in fact exactly 1% here at 50 milliliters. In this picture, we can see that the graduated cylinder has been filled to 25 milliliters, and by comparing the measurement of the grad cylinder to a weight, uh, where we would measure it out to expecting 25 grams, in fact, the error is now 4%, close to, again, a milliliter error at the 25 milliliter mark.